Hi again. In this question, we're going to take a look at a macro topic, and that's intervention in the currency market. And here's the question. The diagram shows the market for sterling pounds, which is in equilibrium. It's currently in equilibrium at a price of two US dollars uh, to the pound with 25 billion pounds traded. What must the UK government do to achieve an exchange rate of one pound buys US dollar $2.50. Have a go, press the pause button. When you come back, I'll be with you with the right answer and the explanation. And the correct answer to this question is A. The government or the central bank operating on the government's behalf must go into the market and buy £10 billion of sterling. So what's the reasoning behind this? Well, think about the diagram. We're currently at $2 to the pound. But the, we're told the government wants to appreciate the exchange rate from $2 to the pound to $2.50. So that clearly needs the price to go up. They could use interest rates, but we're not given that as part of the options. It's clearly going to be intervention in the market. The central bank, for example, the Bank of England, if this was the case, needs to go into the market and accumulate buy pounds to increase demand. So what needs to happen is that the central bank needs to increase the demand curve from D to D2 to reach this new equilibrium here at $2.50. Well, we've shifted the demand out by 10 billion pounds at each price level. That's the, that's the scale of the intervention required to nudge the equilibrium value of the pound up to $2.50. Hence, the answer to this question is A.